Hello my dear YouTube subscribers and YouTube travelers, welcome back or welcome to my channel. <clears throat> Today's video is uh, testing the possibility of using the same email account uh, you already used for a previous GCK account. I do believe if you already have active GCK account with a specific email address, uh, you cannot open the second GCK account with the same email address. I'm going to test that possibility with the screen and uh, I will try to, uh, and then once I uh, try to open my second account, I will see what the options are. Then I'm going to go back to the previous initial account and revoke it. And then I will try to build a new GCK account again with the same email address. So let's start right away. So, uh, so I'm just gonna go back to, sorry about that, GCK login. Okay, so I don't have, I'm gonna register. Which is kind of funny, this kind of goes back in circles. So I'm gonna sign up, I'm gonna accept, and I'm gonna deal username okay we have to use different character so I'm gonna create my password ah, it's good enough for the test continue okay so now this is just a random um, questions and hints. Singer Rock. I'm gonna put today's date. Oops. All the way. Video. So I'm just gonna take a picture of these. I'm using it for the test. I'm gonna continue. Okay, so let's see email address. I never use my Gmail account um, for the GC key. So I'm gonna continue. So your username is please select to continue to verify your email address and the confirmation code came through so I'm just gonna quickly go to my gmail account and take a look what is my confirmation code so I got the email from GCK Canada and my confirmation code is here continue and continue accept okay so I'm gonna so I'm gonna fill my information and give a name I'm just gonna put short and sweet sorry email address six at gmail.com English continue now I have to create security questions and answers. Okay, um, I'm gonna take a picture of this as well. Question must have at least 10 characters. So when we look at 
my account profile we have Ella's workshop 76 at the gmail.com and this is it so I'm gonna log out continue all right so now we're gonna try to create another GCQ account while this one is still active so let's see going back to the same place I accept now the challenge is to create another username so let's see um, LS shop 76 And let's see if this is going to work. Create a password. So now I'm going to use the same email address, 76, oops, gmail.com, see, copy, paste, continue, okay, so the email address, ellasworkshop76gmail.com is already in use by another GCQ account. Each GCQ account must have a unique email address associated with it. By confirming this email address on the next screen, it will be removed from the other GCQ account. Okay, so in this case, I don't want to proceed. I'm going to go back and um, I am not going to create this uh, GCQ account. What I'm going to do, I am going to first revoke my previous account and try to create a new GCQ account. So if you have existive, um, existing GCQ account that is still active, you should not be creating a new GCQ account with the uh, same email address. For some reason, if you're still using that old account and you still have all the applications there, don't, don't mess with the second GCQ account with the same email address. Uh, try to create an, I don't know, and usually people don't need the two GCQ accounts, but uh, if you're trying to create another one for some reason for yourself, it's not going to work because you're going to have to now probably uh, link all those applications back to your new GCQ account because you're going to lose the access to your old account. So don't do it. But what I'm going to do right now, I'm going to go back to the previously created GCQ account with the same email address and I'm going to revoke it. And then I'm going to try create a new GCQ account after that account is being revoked or locked. Uh, either way, I think it, it's going to do the same thing. Either if it's locked or revoked, it should be the same thing. So let's cancel this. And I'm going to go back to my previous account. So I'm going to have to go to see my previous username. And uh, we use this site. 22 password sign in okay so it's no problem to go back into it continue okay Ella Okay, so while I'm still here, I am going to revoke my GC key, enter the current password, continue, and continue. So I'm going to go back in again to see if 
I can still access it, which it shouldn't happen because I just revoked it. Okay, so it is revoked. All right. So let's go back into it. I opened so many windows right now. Okay. So I am going to register GCK, sign up, I accept. Okay, so I don't know if I can still use the same username, but let's test it. Username is not, username is not available, so it wouldn't let me. So I'm gonna create a new. Because it's just it's just been uh, revoked. Maybe that's the reason. So now I'm gonna create a password, which is the same again. You can use the same password all over. That's not gonna be a problem. So again, security, even recovery questions. Um, can be the same as you can see because they're not seems like giving you a hard time on these they their system is not catching it uh, video continue now I'm gonna use the same Gmail address, copy paste. Okay, so it led me to use the same email address, but I had to change my username. So now they're sending me another confirmation code on the Gmail address. I'm gonna take a look and sign in so there's a second email right now coming through so i'm basically doing everything in one day 772 wk f y 2 continue and continue and continue i accept create an account give a name Ella M, same thing, so Ella's work shop76 at gmail.com English. And now again, I have to do the security questions, but uh, in general, you can use the same email address if your account has been revoked or locked. They will uh, not give you a hard time on that, but it seems like the username has to be different because their database is actually catching that username and it's um, it, it, it seems like it has to be unique. So just try to use different username and then uh, you can use that same email address. But if your GCK account is still active and for some reason you want to build another GCK account with that same email address, it's not uh, uh, what you're gonna, what is going to happen is that you're going to move on to the G different GCK account, the new one, and you will. Uh, I don't know if you can have an access. I do believe. Um, I, I, I'm not sure if you can have an access to the old GCK account, but for some reason, I didn't test that right now. Maybe I could do it. Uh, but since I didn't have any applications on my test account, I cannot tell you if that is a smart thing to do. So if you have an active GCK account and you still have applications on them, of course you don't need a second GCK account. But like I said, if for some reason you want to create, like me, a test account or do something with the same email address, uh, don't do it. Create a new Gmail, um, sorry, create a new uh, email address doesn't have to be Gmail, it just uh, came out of my mouth, but uh, 
use use different email use different email address and create a new gck account just in case if you want to do like me uh, some testing some uh, recording like this for the youtube that that's fine uh, but don't use the same email address if you still have those active applications on your current uh, GCK account. I hope I'm not repeating myself. Uh, thank you for watching and I hope this clarify some of the confusion uh, with your um, email addresses on GCK accounts. Uh, have a great day, evening, whatever you are and hopefully all goes well with your immigration to Canada. Bye from Ella.